हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल कैट टूटोल्स फॉर बिगिनर्स टू एडवांस सो इन दिस लेक्चर लेट्स डिस्कस अबाउट द नेक्स्ट टाइप ऑफ स्विप कमांड इन जनरेटिव शेप डिजाइन सो इन दिस लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द सर्कल प्रोफाइल टाइप विद टू गाइड्स एंड टेंजेज इज फेस सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द शेप डिजाइन हियर सो स्टार्ट देन शेप एंड दी जनरेटिव शेप डिजाइन and then i will keep uh, the uh, name as it is here so here we are in the uh, generative shape design uh, workbench so if you hover over this option you can see we are in the generative shape design so let's see uh, what are the inputs required uh, for this sub type here so if you click on the sip the shape surface definition dialog box uh, comes up and then uh, you can see uh, we are in the circle profile type and then here uh, we are going to see uh, these two guides and and this is a face so let's select this and you will see what are the inputs required for this uh, command so here the first is limit uh, curve with a tangency the second one is tangency surface so the s here uh, is nothing but a tangency surface and then limit curve so limit curve we can see that the g2 is as a limit curve and then limit curve with tangency is nothing but this g1 okay so uh, we need this uh, inputs first and then we can use this command to Uh, create the sweep surface, and uh, as usual, we have a relimiter one and relimiter two, uh, which we can use uh, based on our requirement. So let's cancel this, and we'll see the practical demonstration of this. So let us uh, draw a sketch here. So I will sketch uh, on this uh, front plane, and then uh, let's click on OK here, and then we'll use uh, the arc. So let's create one arc here. Simple arc will create uh, the last one. just select the center and then uh, you need to provide the two points here two points here okay and then maybe you can you can provide the dimension as well if you want so let's provide a dimension uh, let's keep it as 100 and then exit workbench so uh, uh, first we will create the tangency surface here okay so let's use the extrude command so just expand this you will see the sketch one here and then uh, let's select the extrude command so here you can see uh, the direction uh, which is uh, default selected and then you can just simply uh, provide this uh, limit here so maybe uh, i will uh, give in the reverse direction so let's provide as uh, 500 or maybe uh, let's say 300 just preview it and click on okay so now here uh, we have uh, this as a tangency surface and then uh, this edge uh, we can use as a limit curve with a tangency surface so uh, again we'll create a limit curve so let's uh, select the sketch here and then we'll uh, sketch on this top plane here just align the axis is here and then uh, you can create a simple line just create a simple line here and then maybe uh, you can draw this line Uh, just keep this as vertical for now and then vertical and then again exit the workbench so here uh, this is nothing but a limit curve so let's use the sweep command now and then uh, the limit curve with the tangency is this one then the tangency surface just provide this as a tangency surface and then limit curve this is a limit curve we can uh, provide here and then try previewing it so you can see uh, again there are lot of solutions uh, there are two solutions here so this is the one solution if you uh, just click on okay you can see uh, the uh, sweep has been created with the solution one and if you want to uh, change the direction here you can see right the yellow area here just click on preview and okay here so here uh, in this way you can you can use this sweep type so uh, here uh, if you double click on it and you have Relimiter one and relimiter two as well. So again, you can you can use uh, this uh, to create this uh, uh, the surface as per your uh, requirement. So let's try this. Uh, I will use uh, the relimiter one here and just create a plane again, and we'll use uh, this uh, curve here. Let's select the curve normal to the curve, and then uh, just uh, we have selected already selected the curve here. and then we'll keep uh, it in the middle so just click on okay and if you preview it you can see uh, this is the 
uh, sweep has been created on this side so if you want uh, on the other other side you can just click on the uh, green icon or green arrow here and then uh, you can see uh, in the preview that the uh, sweep has been created on the other side so just click ok and you can see uh, in this way you can create uh, the sweep surface with this command circle profile type with two guides and tangent surface so this uh, basically this surface is tangent to this uh, tangency surface here so if you see here these these both are tangents again if you if you want to create one more here you can just try out th uh, that as well so just create a point and again i will uh, just use uh, on a curve here and then uh, you can you can select the curve so just select this curvature here and then uh, on the ratio you can provide the ratio so let's provide it as uh, 0.9 currently so just click on ok and then uh, try previewing it so actually here uh, it's it's going on the other direction so that's why maybe it is uh, throwing an error so you can change that just click on ok here i will uh, uh, let me again double click on it so here uh, we have done a wrong thing here let's uh, change this maybe first we'll clear it and then again uh, select the plane here uh, just select this normal to the curve and then point we have already created one point here so we can select that okay and then click on ok and then now it will uh, it will not throw any error maybe we can just try it here and now you can see uh, the surface is created in between these two millimeters so just click on ok and you can see the uh, sweep is, has been created okay so if you double click it and if you try to change the solution again you can do that and you can see the sweep is created so again if you try to uh, show this i did uh, plane sh let's show them and you can see uh, the sweep has been created in between these two millimeters so that's it for this uh, command we can uh, we can do the sweep which is tangent to the existing surface so thanks for watching this video hope you have enjoyed watching it please do subscribe our youtube channel for such more videos thank you so much